Hey guys, what is up? It's Dominic, and in this video, we're going to be breaking down the brand new AI employee inside of Go High Level. Now, as a lot of you may know, Go High Level has been experimenting with AI for the last year. And the reason they put so much time and effort and money into AI is because it is the future. If you actually break it down and use common sense, then you will quickly understand why AI is so important and why it's changing the game forever. And in this video, I'm gonna show you some of the awesome features that are coming out and some of the features that you can get right now. But before I get into the video, I wanna break down a few different things for anyone who's brand new to the channel and has no idea who I am. My name is Dominic Baptist. I'm actually one of the top affiliates in the world of all time for Go High Level. And the way that I got to be one of the top affiliates of all time is by being extremely hands-on with my students. I have a very, very high success rate with everyone who signs up with my affiliate link. When you sign up with my 30-day free trial, which will be in the link in the description below, you're not only gonna get my free startup course and my second course, which has a white labeled onboarding for you and all of your clients, but you're also gonna get in contact with me personally, and I will do whatever I have to do to make sure that you succeed. So I promise you will not be disappointed. You will have every resource that you need to succeed if you choose me. And speaking of the affiliate program, you may or may not have seen this three-day workshop, which is probably being sent to you by a ton of different people through email. Well, this three-day workshop is actually going to break down everything you need to know about the brand new AI feature. So definitely enroll. I'm going to leave my link in the description below. This is an affiliate link as well. So if you guys want to support me in any way possible, this is a huge way. All you have to do is click on my link and enroll with me. And it's completely free, as you can see right here. You do not have to pay anything to go to this workshop. But at the end of the year and when 2025 starts on January 1st, every single Go High Level account, including you, will be given the option to get a $97 a month add-on where you get unlimited access to the AI employee. This feature is insane. Now, do you have to do the $97 a month plan? No, you can actually pay per usage if you want. But for anyone out there who's trying to start a successful agency and wants to build it on the backbone of AI, then I do highly recommend getting that $97 plan. And if you use my link, then reach out to me. I'll throw something your way. I have not tested this out yet. It's brand new to me. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here to where it says season of AI and I'm going to opt in for the AI employee. A pop-up window is going to come up and it's going to ask me to customize my plan. It says, do you want to charge a certain amount for using AI employee feature from the 1st of January, 2025? So we have two different options here. We can either charge from the location. So that means we can edit how much we charge or we can click on do not charge location. For this scenario, we're going to put do not charge. Then it's going to bring up that $97 a month plan that I told you about earlier. So we're just going to select one of the plans. So if you want to do the $97 a month, you're not going to have any of those fees. But if you click on pay as you go, as you can see right here, these are the fees. We've got 13 cents a minute for voice AI, two cents per message on conversation AI, eight cents per response on review AI, 99 cents per funnel and website, nine cents per a thousand words on content AI, and two cents per message on workflow AI assistant. So these can actually add up really, really fast. And that's why I always think the subscription method is better. So that's the one that we're going to be using in this example. And then we're going to click on start using AI employee. Now, of course, you will be reminded on January 1st about which one you chose. And at the end of the year, if they ask you if you're going to stick with this plan, there's actually an affiliate code that you can put in for me specifically. And my affiliate code is Dom Baptist, D-O-M-B-A-P-T-I-S-T. -I, I will leave it in the description below. I'll put it right here on the screen. Pretty easy to remember, just Dom Baptist. So if you guys are going to get it anyway, and you want to show me some love, toss my name in there. I promise I appreciate it a lot. And send me a DM, show me proof that you did it. I will give you access to every single course that I have. And I have a lot of them. But either way, we are successfully opted in. And now we can start playing around with this employee AI for free. The first one I want to click on is the voice. AI over here to the left. And this is going to take you inside of a sub account over to the settings area under voice AI agents. So let's click on create agent up here at the top, right? We've got the agent name. So let's change this. I change it to AI voice bot. We've got the business name right here and check this out. We've got the voice. So we get to decide what we want the voice to sound like. We've got Samantha. Let's play her voice. Before you put on a frown, make absolutely sure there are no smiles available. All right, let's try out Charles. There's power in looking silly and not caring that you do. Let's go down here to Phoebe. The greatest part of our happiness depends on our dispositions, not our circumstances. So as you can see, there's a ton of different voices that you can choose from. And this is basically going to be the voice of your new AI voice robot. We've got inbound calling. This is for when the agent picks up an incoming call. And outbound calling is coming soon. That's going to be more for cold calling purposes. And then, of course, we've got the agent's initial message down here. Hey, you have reached Serio Systems. How can I help you today? So if I wanted to change this, I could change it right here. But for right now, that works. So I'm going to click on next. Now we have the agent's goals. So this is setting up the agent's personality and actions. So it's asking us what details do we want to collect from the contact? We definitely want the name. We want the email. And depending on what your business is, you might want the address or the contacts issues. I'm going to click on the contacts issues for now. And for this scenario, I'm not going to do the address, but I can give you a really good example for where the address would be needed. Let's say you're setting this up for a lawn care business and the lawn care business needs to know the address in order to go and do the lawn care services. And of course, you're going to have the AI robot ask for the address and put it into the contact information. So in that scenario, you would check this on. Next, we have three different check marks down here. The ad call summary as a note to the contact is already going to be checked, but we have trigger workflow when call is completed. And then we have receive email notification 
notification post call completion. By default, email is sent to the sub account admins at the end of each call. So if you want to check mark any of these, you can do that too. My mind is actually spinning right now. This is the first time I've seen all of this. And there are so many different things and scenarios that we're going to be able to do in the future. So many awesome snapshots, so many cool videos to make. I cannot wait, guys. You're about to see at least 20 more AI videos from me. And you know how I am. I'm a simple guy. I'm not going to make it advanced or crazy. I'm going to make sure all of us understand it perfectly well. All right, let's click on next. Next, we've got phone and availability. So you're going to click on the phone number. And you're just going to click on the phone number that's associated with the business. You can even set working hours for the agent. So let's say your business is only running from Monday to Friday and your call hours are from 9 to 4 p.m. Then we're going to click on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And you can change all the different times in here too. And I can actually just click this copy button right here. Copy it from Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and then click apply. And there you go. It changed from nine to four for every single one. Now we're going to click on save. And there we go. We just created our first AI voice robot. But I have a lot more to get through. So let's move on to the conversation AI. Now, if you click on conversation AI over here, this is actually going to be the first version. So if you already have some conversation AI bots that you've made, you can just move them over to V2 by clicking this button right here. And it's going to take you down here to conversation AI V2, which of course is the one that we're going to be using in this video. So let's click on create bot again. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to set up the bot's name. I'm going to call him AI helper. Now we need to set the bot status. Do we want him off or do we want to do autopilot, which will send messages automatically? Now be careful about this because if you turn this on, yes, your clients might get messages from you due to the fact that it is AI. Now, no, it's not going to take over your entire business and become evil. At least I hope not, but it definitely can respond to people. And if the bot's not properly trained, then it might not give the best responses. So for right now, we're going to click off. And then down here, we have all the supported channels. So if you want your AI bot to respond on Instagram, Facebook, SMS, chat widget, and live chat, you can do that right there. And right here, we have AI bot trial where you can ask it questions based on your training data. So let's click on that right here. And this is going to take us over to the bot goals. Now, this is where it starts getting a little intense. I understand it might be a little scary at first. And like I said, I haven't messed around with this yet, but right here we have the prompts. Now, the prompts are very, very important when training an AI bot because this basically describes the AI bot's entire personality. And yes, you can change this right here. As you can see under the personality, you are a bot for AI business name tasked to assist customers. Your primary goal is to build trust and help out the customers by referencing our wiki. You cannot help with appointment bookings, appointment cancellations, rescheduling, politely let the customer know you cannot help them with these appointments. So these are all things that you can change. You can do whatever you want. You can train this bot the exact way that you would train an employee. So if you have someone coming in to be a secretary or an assistant, I'm not saying you should replace that person with an AI robot, but for a lot of business owners, they can't afford a secretary right now, or they can't afford an assistant. So this is a great way to get started. You can put in the personality right here. You can put in all the intent, the additional information, examples, everything that you could ever imagine you can put right here. And then once you've done that, you can go test out your robot over here to the right by saying, hello, Hey there, what's on your mind today? And as of right now, the robot probably doesn't know a lot, so I'm not gonna ask it any questions because I haven't trained it yet. So I'm gonna come over here to bot training, and this is where you can train your bot. So the first thing you can do is actually put in your website or any type of URL that you want the robot to learn. So I'm gonna type in www.seriosystems.com and click get data. And then it's gonna say uploaded links, one link. We're gonna click on this little arrow right here. And as you can see, we've got the status and trained. It already went through the entire website and trained itself on my entire site. This is actually insane. I can also come down here to customize the bot responses on add Q&A. So I can actually add questions that might be asked and give answers based on how I want AI to answer my questions. So for the question, I'm going to write who is Dominic Baptist. Then I'm going to give the answer that I personally like the best. As you can see right here, I wrote Dominic Baptist is one of the top affiliates in the world for the software Go I Level. He has over three years of experience in the software industry and helped over 10,000 people start their SaaS agencies. So I'm going to click on save and then I'm going to come over here to the AI bot. And of course, I'm going to ask who Dominic Baptist is. And there we go. The AI bot responded with Dominic Baptist is a top affiliate for Go high level with over three years in the software industry, helping 10,000 plus people start SaaS agencies. I mean, that's pretty awesome. I can't even believe how many videos I'm about to make on this because even though this is pretty generalized AI and you guys have all seen something like it, I think it really does change the game. I think it changes everything about how we look stuff up. I think businesses can really adapt to this model way easier than they're probably presuming right now because a lot of the business owners that I talk to, especially business owners that are in their 50s, 60s, 70s, they are terrified of AI. They don't know what to do. They don't know how to add an AI bot. They don't even know what that means. Means. So if you can come in here and explain this and show them this, copy their website right here, ask the AI bot about their site, which it will literally study in seconds. I mean, that's pretty awesome to me. And like I said, I'm going to make entire videos on just the AI bot training alone because there are so many things that we can do with this. Like just giving an example right out the gate, I recently started a telecommunications company with my aunt. And the first thing I'm going to do is make sure we have an AI bot in place because in telecommunications, there are a ton of questions. What are the text message and phone bill rates? Which providers are best for me? How do I get in contact? 
contact with you? How do I renew my contract? How do I get faster internet speeds? All of these different things are going to be asked by every single customer that we work with. And having an AI bot that's trained on the website itself and trained on answering questions like this is insane. It's going to make our lives so much easier and I can't wait to get it started. I'm going to film the entire process so that you guys can see it and do it for yourselves and for your own businesses. It's also going to be one of the easiest things to sell ever. Like I could walk into a business right now. Hey, what's up? I'm selling an AI chatbot. Basically, it's going to study your entire business in seconds, understand everything that you know, and then answer questions automatically without you lifting a finger. I mean, that's huge for every single business. The response time is immediate. The answers are precise and correct almost every single time, depending on how you train the bot. And it is the future of tech and an industry wave that every single small business is going to have to get on. So if you go out and sell this for a hundred bucks a month, 200 bucks a month, 300 bucks a month, I promise you, you're going to crush it. And don't worry, I'm going to make videos on how to sell this too. I even have like 10 businesses reaching out right now. So I can show you how I sell to them and I can show you how I get them hooked up. All right, guys, for right now, that's all I'm going to do on the AI bot because I do really want to make videos on this completely that are separate from this video. But so far, this looks really cool. All right, guys, now we are in the automation section where I'm going to click on create new workflow and we're going to check out the AI workflow bot. So let's click on create new workflow, start from scratch. And as you can see down here, we have this little AI bot right here where it says workflow AI and it's in beta. So hi, Dominic, I am workflow AI and I can help you with creating automations, understanding workflows and more. How can I help you today? So the first one I'm going to click on is describe the workflow. The first message right here is just explaining what a workflow is. But let's say I want to build a workflow and I want AI to do it for me and I have no idea how to do it. So let's click on type message and I'm just going to type in something that I want automated, but I don't know how to build it. So right here I typed in, I would like to build an automation for an opt-in page on my website that collects phone numbers and sends out text message reminders for awesome deals my store is offering. I'm going to click on send and let's see what it does. And within seconds, we've got an entire setup right here. AI said, that sounds like a great way to engage with customers. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do it. Set up a trigger for when someone opts into your page. Typically, this could be a form submission or a specific event on your website. That's correct. Next, we have collect phone numbers. Ensure the opt-in form on your website collects the phone numbers. This will be crucial for sending out text reminders. Next, we have create a new workflow. Start a new workflow in your automation platform and name it something like opt-in deal reminders. Then we have add trigger event again. Use the opt-in event as the trigger to start the workflow. This will begin the automation whenever someone fills out the form. Number five says send a welcome message. Add an action to send the initial text message. Number six is schedule the text message reminders. Add actions to send text reminders. Seven right here is test the workflow, ensure everything is working by testing it. And eight is activate the workflow, which is of course turning it from draft to publish. And then it says, please let me know if you want more details on how to do this. And then down here, it even gives you suggestions for the SMS, email, the wait times, the task notifications. I mean, this is insane. Now, the one thing I will say is it doesn't actually create the workflow over here. And maybe I'm wrong on that. If I am wrong on that and it does exist, let me know. And I'm sure Go level is working on that because that would be insane if I could just tell AI to create the workflow for me and it did that right here. But it gives you everything you would ever need to know and you can just keep asking it questions down here and it will give you the answers. So this is a huge deal. It's like GHL support times a thousand. And I really think it's going to come in handy for a lot of people who are struggling with building their own workflows. And like I said, in the future, AI is going to be insane. I think you're going to be able to type in anything you want in an entire workflow. is just going to be created right there. And I bet it's going to create the funnel page. It's going to create the automations. It's going to create the form. It's going to create the privacy policy. At one point, we're not even going to have to do anything. We're just going to be the facilitators for all these other businesses, which is great. We're like consultants. Someone has to know how to control the bot in order to sell the bot. So that's kind of where I think all this is going. All right, guys, now we are on the websites tab. So this is for funnels and website building. So I'm going to stay here on funnels and I'm going to click on new funnel over here at the top right and check this out. We've got funnel AI. So I'm going to click on funnel AI. I'm going to click continue. And it's going to ask me, what is the name of the business that I want to use? So for this one, I'm going to use a business that I know of. It's called NS property maintenance. Then we're going to select the industry. I typed in lawn and I'm looking for lawn care services, which is right here. After that, it's going to charge you a dollar per funnel because this is basically like hiring someone to build the funnel for you. But let's see what it looks like. So just be careful about using your five entries because yes, you will get charged after that. But let's check it out. We're going to click on next. It's going to ask you what design preference you're looking for. So do we want to generate more leads, get more appointments, showcase your services or sell products and services? I'm going to stick with generate more leads. And then right here, it says, do you want the content to feel friendly, professional, inspirational, conversational, humorous, sarcastic, or persuasive? For this one, I'm actually going to click on professional and then we're going to click on generate. All right, let's see what it does. Let's see if AI can make a funnel better than me. And here we are. I created a funnel. AI just made this entire funnel for me. This does look really, really professional. I like it a lot. There are some things I would definitely change, but ultimately this is a great starting point. I think for my taste, it's a little feminine. The color schemes and definitely the font right here. But once again, we just needed a starting point to put in all of our photos. I feel like I won't have to change much of the actual format. That means I can get this entire website done and ready for the client in under an hour easily. So I'm pretty happy with this. Would it be worth a dollar in the future? Yeah, for sure. Because it would have taken me hours to go through all of this. But do I still think it could be improved? 100%. All right, next, guys, we're going to go over to the marketing section under the social planner for content AI.
AI. So I'm gonna click on new post. I'm gonna click on one of the social media accounts that I have. For this scenario, we're just gonna choose Google. And then right here, we have this little AI bot. So let's click on it. We're gonna click on generate with AI. So it says generate content with AI. This feature is a paid service and will incur charges based on your usage. So please remember that. But this is basically AI creating the content for us on our social media planner. So in a perfect world, if you're gonna be using this and selling this to clients, then it seems really easy to sell. Then even if you're not gonna use it with that client, it's definitely an easy selling point because basically you're saying, hey, we have an AI robot that will actually create the content for you, help with all your posting, your descriptions, your captions. Once again, this is kind of where AI is going and generating content is gonna be one of the first things that it does. So the first thing we're gonna do is generate the content title, new AI robot helper, provide a brief content description. I wrote down Serial Systems is introducing its brand new AI robot helper that can help any and all small to medium sized businesses with their heavy workloads. Next, you can add keywords. So for the keywords, I wrote down AI helper assistant and robot. For the writing tone, you can do funny, casual, excited, professional, witty, sarcastic. I'm gonna do excited. And then for number of variations, we'll stick with three. And then the length of the content, let's do medium. And let's see what it does. We're gonna click generate. And here we go. We've got the first variation right here. Big news from Serio Systems. We're beyond excited to unveil our latest innovation that's about to transform your business operations. The new AI robot helper is here, designed specifically for small to medium sized businesses. This isn't just any assistant, it's your future go to for tackling those heavy workloads with ease. Imagine having an AI powered partner that's ready to go 24 7, streamlining tasks and boosting productivity like never before. That's the kind of game changing support we're talking about. Why settle for less when you can have a robot helper that's equipped with cutting edge technology? It's time to embrace efficiency and let our AI assistant handle the complexities so you can focus on growing your business. Don't miss out on this opportunity to be at the forefront of the technological revolution. Get ready to work smarter, not harder with Serio Systems AI Robot Helper. Then it puts all the hashtags in, shows you it's 155 words, and gives you the second variation as well, which I'm not going to read, and the third one down here. So you're basically just going to pick the variation you want, paste it over here. It's going to paste over here automatically, and then you can click on continue. Now let's say we want to add a photo. Well, we can actually create the image using AI as well. So describe your image, brand new AI Robot Helper. Let's do three different variations, and then we have to choose our image style. Do we want dreamlike, animated, photo, colorful, watercolor? Let's do dreamlike, and then click generate. Okay, so this is actually terrifying. I probably won't use this one, but it is kind of cool. It just doesn't look very friendly. So I'm going to click on cancel. All right, guys, after playing around with this for a while, the AI photos can be a little strange. So if you don't want to use them for your post, you don't have to. I think AI photos and AI videos are one of those things that are just going to get better over time. So I'm not going to sit here and lie to you. I personally would not be using these. I would just go get a photo off Google or a photo that you take. Like for instance, if I typed in lawn care, these photos are beautiful, but they look insane. Obviously, no one's going to believe that you're mowing this lawn. It would be way smarter for you to just go mow a lawn and actually take a photo of it with your phone. But once again, AI is trying, they're going to get better at this content stuff. And if you wanted to use the photo for the post, you can click continue and then it's going to show right there and you're good to go. Obviously this photo has nothing to do with the post, but I just wanted to show you guys how it works. And who knows, maybe you guys will love it. I just think this one needs a little bit more work. All right guys. And last on the AI list, we have AI reviews, which you're going to come down here to reputation management and then click on settings. And then we've got reviews AI right here where you can turn it on and off. You can do suggestive or you can have auto responses. So the first thing you need to do is choose the source. We can do Google or Facebook. Let's do Google reviews. And then you can have the autoresponder right here. Auto response sent to five stars, four stars or above, three, two, or one star. Let's do all. We can have a wait time. So let's do two minutes. And then down here it says review response footer. Example says thank you. So we can type that in and then we can click on save. So now we can have AI automatically responding to every single review that we have. Now is this cool? Yeah. Is it life changing? No. I think it's just another thing that Go Island can add to make all of our services seem really up to date, which of course they are. But this right here isn't as exciting as the other ones that we talked about earlier in this video. And the one I'm most excited for by far is the conversation AI bot. That's the one I'm going to be making more videos on. I'll make videos with my buddy Preston, who's an AI freak and Connor, who's one of the top affiliates for Go High Level 2. So there's going to be a lot coming from my channel in the future. Make sure you like and subscribe so you can stay tuned. And then of course, once again, make sure to use my link in the description below when going to this three-day workshop. I cannot express how much I will appreciate it. Any support that I get in this affiliate game is huge. Obviously, Go High Level means the world to me. And the more people I bring to Go High Level, the happier the company is with me and my content and everything that I've worked for for the last three years. So if you enjoy anything that I've done, all the videos that I put in, all the free courses, that you're going to get. And all I ask is that you support me with these affiliate links. You're never paying me directly. It's all just going straight to the company. And I love this model of teaching versus the old style where you'd have to pay me thousands of dollars for me to coach you. I don't love that model because a lot of starting out entrepreneurs don't have a lot of money to start. Trust me, I know I was one of those people. And the ability to go in here, learn everything you'd ever need to know about the business before starting is so cool. So if you're one of those people that doesn't use affiliate links, please start using them. You get the exact same software, the exact same product, the exact same service, but you're just helping the content creator that got you to it. And in return, the 
Perfect Content Creator is gonna give you everything you would ever need to succeed, which includes every single one of my courses, all my snapshots, literally everything, which if you've seen any of my videos in the past, you already know what that is. But if you haven't, go check them out. I have hundreds. Either way, that's enough yapping out of me. I just wanted to get this video out as quickly as possible so you guys don't miss this three-day workshop. For the hundredth time, the link in the description below. Thank you guys so much, and I will see you in the next video. Peace out.